Ben Ross was a terrific photographer. He was a creative curmudgeon, and lots of people knew him, and he, he always spoke his mind. He didn't really realize who she was. He didn't know much about starlets. He called her a starlet. And uh, Life and lots of the magazines suggested, let's get a beat on Monroe. Let's really get down there. Let's get the shots, because we don't know what this is going to blossom into. Um, of course, we know now. So she showed up at his hotel room door. She just felt totally rested. It was almost midnight, maybe 11.30, and knocked on the door. He opened it. He was astounded, and he said, Hi. And she said, I'm ready for my close-up. I'm ready for some photos. How about we do a shoot now? Just you and me, just in a relaxed place. Where do you want to go, he said. And she said, well, how about the hotel room? Right here, right where you're staying. And so they got together. She came in, and he was like, I don't know if I have enough film. I don't know what's really happening. So he said, okay. She just went through this whole gamut of emotions, from fear to laughter, and the difference between tickle laughter and gentle laughter and a big guffaw laughter and um, sadness and she just it was like a rolling thunder just she just changed and sad and smiled and tilted and laid down on the carpet and smoked and he just kept shooting and shooting she seemed to relax very late in the day and maybe that's why she was late. She just, she was not an early person. She started her day. 11 p.m. seemed really good for her. <laughs>